Manscaped is here to up your body grooming game. Manscaped has the revolutionary electric trimmer, the Lawnmower 3.0. It's cordless, it's waterproof, and it's guaranteed not to nick or snag your nuts or your chest because you can use it upstairs and downstairs. So go to manscaped.com, use code HRU for 20% off plus free shipping. When you came into the industry, were you looking at looking at it as like a serious career choice that you were going to stick to? Or was it just something like, Oh, I'll try this for a little bit. I need to like pay off student debt or something, whatever it is. And then yeah. like I'll jump to something else. I didn't really have any expectations. I knew that it was something I was really curious about and I really wanted to try. And I, I genuinely didn't have expectations of like, I'm going to do this just for like a couple of months and that's it. Or, or I'm going to try and make a career out of it. But I liked all of the options, all of the ideas at the time. So I was like, I'm just going to try it and see how it feels and go from there. And once I was finally like really in the industry and had a handful of scenes under my belt, I was like, okay, yeah, this is something I want to do. So it, it took me experiencing it to really know what I wanted. Yeah. Yeah. What about the adult industry surprised you the most? Like when you got into it, were there, like, what did you, what were some of these stereotypes perhaps for you that were shattered? Ah, let me think. Um, I guess I didn't expect productions to, like, I I thought it was kind of like a one man show kind of deal. When you'd show up to set, it's like a POV style thing. I didn't think there was going to be a whole crew. I didn't think it was going to be like, a well-oiled machine working like as professional as it was. So that really surprised me and I was really pleased. So that was another reason why I was so happy to jump in and be like, I'm like, okay, everything's just as professional as, I mean, I, I mean, I just didn't expect that. Um, and then at the time I was really socially anxious. So I was super, super nervous to interact with people in a professional environment. I, I like did not know how to socialize when I first got in. So, Um, I think I had this weird expectation that people are going to be super serious and like not nice and not want to help me and, and help me to, to learn more about how to perform, how to grow as a performer. Um, so when I finally grew the courage to like try and start asking people like, Hey, like, what is your advice for me? Like, do you, do you have anything to offer me? I, everyone was so, so, so kind and so welcoming. And I really just was I had no reason to be fearful (laughs) but yeah yeah, it was it was uh, I mean I think I think porn really ended up being a whole experience for me where I kind of just grew into myself within this industry because I mean I came in with crippling social social anxiety and did not know how to interact with people at just like a base level and it it turned into this you know, self-discovery experience through sexuality, through, you know, all of these super incredible people that just were like, I don't know, just very supportive of me and very kind. And yeah, I just had a great experience and I'm, I feel like I've come into my, my own in this business. So I've heard that from so many people Mm -hmm. and the common misconception is that porn destroys you and that porn will traumatize you. And it certainly has happened to people. You know, unfortunately, everybody's experience is different. And sometimes girls get mixed up with the wrong agent or they, you know, do the wrong productions right Mm -hmm. off the bat. But it can be a really amazing experience for some people and really help people grow, you know, in terms of their sexuality, but Mm -hmm. also, yeah, in terms of just relationships with people. Because porn is one of those interesting places where, you're working with so many different people and so many different personalities. Yeah. I mean, every set's different. Every mm-hmm. director is different. And then also having to be intimate with all these different people yes. with different preferences and different personalities. Mm-hmm. So it's almost like this really intense training yeah. <laughs> to oh, like yeah. get along with other yeah. people. Thrown into the fire. Yeah. yeah. And I, I mean, that, that really was everything for me. I, I was absolutely terrified of it. But as soon as I was in it, I saw that like it wasn't as intimidating as it all seemed. And, and yeah, I mean, I think there is that stereotype that like porn can ruin people or people can have terrible experiences. Like you said, like everyone has their own experience, but I feel like I was so lucky to just come in at a time where 
everyone around me was just so excited for me. I just, mm-hmm. I really felt other people's excitement and it got me excited and it, it changed everything for me. I mean, I, I have grown so much as a person just within this industry and I really credit it all to just the people that I was surrounded by. So, and yeah. And <laughs> I, will, I, I will tell you from a producer's perspective that it's really refreshing to work with people who are serious about their their career mm-hmm. and who, you know, people who take the time, like people who pull me aside to say like, what could I do to be better? That's so appreciated because I'm like, oh, you take this seriously. Yeah. Like you actually want, want to improve mm-hmm. because, you know, there's quite a few people that I work with and actually I just had the experience like this week where they're just not really serious about it. Yeah. They're just kind of like here mm-hmm. and like whatever. And I don't really have a ton of consideration for your time. And this is just a big party. And I'm, you know, just going to like be high all the time. And, <sighs> and you know what I mean? And yeah. whatever it's, it's, and there are some people who, um, I think maybe get into the industry a little young and, yeah, and we all, you know, have room to grow. I mean, I certainly was, you know, not the brightest person or the most motivated or the most serious about anything at 18, 19, yeah, 20. Definitely. So, um, but when you do come across people who are like, you know, I really take this seriously and I, I want to be professional and I want to improve. It's just like, oh my gosh, let me help you yes. do that mm-hmm. because we want more of that. Mm-hmm. You know, it makes my life so much easier if I'm working with people who really care about what they're creating. Yes. And so. I didn't know anything. So I, I just, I'm like, I'm going to ask all the people around me who I know are successful and Mm -hmm. who care about what they're doing. And I seem to get along with, like, I, I didn't see any harm in just asking. I didn't see like any sort of criticism as a negative thing either too. I wanted to hear like what I could do better. And I think those I'm now, whenever I meet newer girls and, and it seems either they're in that space that you were describing of just kind of feeling it out and like maybe they care more about getting high or, you know, just going with the flow. Um, it's hard for me to, to want to work with them, but at the same time, I want to just give them that extra bit of love to be like, Hey, like, I mean, it can be different. Like you can, you can take it a little more seriously and see more of a return in, Mm -hmm. in your career. If you actually just give that extra bit of consideration. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Like what you give, um, you know, you can get back tenfold. Mm -hmm. Manscaped is here to up your body grooming game. Their lawnmower 3.0 is a revolutionary electric trimmer that will not only not nick or snag your nuts, but can also be used on your chest hair. If you get it in the perfect package 3.0, it will come with a bunch of liquid formulas to keep you feeling and smelling fresh all day. And for a limited time, you can also get a free travel bag and anti-chafing boxer briefs that come with it. So go to manscaped.com, use code HRU for 20% off plus free shipping. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss a single episode and go check out all the other videos. I film every single one of my podcasts. And if you want to listen to the audio version, I'm on iTunes and all the other podcast platforms. Visit hollyrandallunfiltered.com to find out more.